I have spent a lot of money on vinted parcels. I'm going to show you how much money I'm expecting to make. I want to prove that you can still source stuff off of vinted and that it's possible. As you can see here, the top of a big pile of parcels, there's a lot of stuff here. I'm going to get stuff out, show you what I've bought it for. I don't quite remember, so I've left this big space here to put screenshots and stuff. And I'll probably do a running total, and we'll have a look at how much I have potentially made in profit uh, just sourcing off a of vintage. This is about a week's worth of sourcing. I had a few issues. I'll go through those as well. Um, but yeah, let's get started. So I'm going to start with this one, which is open already because I, I had to check some of this. Because um, I was saving them up for a video, though, there is the potential that some of it I haven't checked in time. So hopefully it all works. Uh, this does work. This is a Fire HD 8. Um, I can guess what I paid for stuff. I think this was about £18. And I think it goes for about 45 maybe. But yeah, one of those. Everyone's probably seen these. Uh, pretty good condition, to be honest. Yeah, that was uh, the first one. These are in no particular order, but uh, yeah, that's the first thing I have to show you. So that was one pickup. I'll put a running total up there and let's get on to the next one. Also, I must apologize. I must. Um, I probably don't look the best. I woke up very early for my real job. Um, I woke up at about 5 a.m. and I'm already feeling it. Uh, I went to bed probably at midnight. So yeah, I'm currently running on about five hours sleep and it is currently about 7 p.m. So apologies for that. Uh, if I look, you know, these I've always got bags under my eyes, let's be honest, but they may be worse today. Uh, we're just gonna grab, it's like Christmas this. I don't remember what's in some of these. I've opened some of them like week a week or two ago um, and then put them back as I sort of uh, got them out. So I'm gonna be remembering as I go. Uh, but this is one, the Evil Within, uh, like a limited edition. I believe I paid like seven quid for it. I think it goes for 15 um complete in there got like all the extra little postcards and stuff but yeah that's quite nice easy little uh little parcel there next up uh, i'll save this one this one's a good one uh what i'll do is i'll grab this one i'm gonna need some scissors as well for some of these um because i haven't opened all of them in advance here we go this is going to be a running theme by the way so uh i've got an echo dot uh alexa brand new seal well, it is brand new, but I don't know if it's meant to move around that much. I don't want to open it to find out, to be honest, but the seal is unbroken. So, yeah, as you can see, if you can see that, yeah. Um, that, again, can't remember. I'll put what I paid and I'll put a sold up. So, yeah, I'll do that for the whole video. I won't keep saying it. So that's one. Uh, of a, I've, I've got more Alexas, just to pre-warn you. Uh, and we've got another game. Minecraft for the PS4. Um, ooh, won't show you that code. <laughs> uh, yeah, Minecraft for the PS4. I believe I paid about eight quid for it. I think it goes for about 20, maybe 18. Something like that. Next up, we've got a big old load of games uh, in a load of bubble wrap. All PS3. So I can't remember what I paid for these. Uh, but we've got GTA 4. Uh, complete with map, I believe, and the uh, handbook. You can see that the map and the handbook is in there. I can't really show you, but it is in there. Uh, disc, obviously, there. Um, very good condition. Next up, we got Red Dead Redemption. I believe this is complete with a map as well. Or no, the poster. Sorry, poster and a manual in there. Uh, that's that's a nice one. Uh, we got Fallout New Vegas here. Complete manual. Um, I don't know why it's got a this box is empty sticker on it because it is not. I've sold that once before for about seven or eight quid, I think, very recently. Um, and then I've got a few more games that aren't as good. Um, we've got Tom Clancy's End War. I'm not actually sure how good that one is. I haven't heard of it, but again, complete. The box needs a bit of a clean, but uh, yeah, it's got stuff in there, manuals and stuff. Uh, and then I got these. These are all part of the same thing, but I, this drew me because I could bundle these together. Got Skyrim and uh, the Elder Scrolls Oblivion. I don't know if these come with any bonuses. They've got the uh, manuals each. No maps. I don't know if they normally come with maps. I don't think so. And then we got Fallout 3. So a couple Fallout games which go fairly well. Since the season 
uh, well, whatever the Fallout season's called. I don't know. I haven't watched it. But since that's come out, the games seem to go a bit better than they used to. Uh, so yeah, there was that bundle of games there. Um, again, I'll put up here what I paid and what I could expect to get back. So I think the total's already probably looking all right. Um, now, I think with vintage purchases, you're never going to get the same return as you get from a car boot. Um, just because car boot sales are really hard to beat anywhere else. Uh, people get rid of stuff very cheap. Vinted, people are more likely to have done their research. But this is all stuff I sniped straight away. Um, or at least, you know, I was sort of refreshing as people put stuff up. This is very good. Uh, beats. These are real, by the way. I did get asked by my mate. Who I... <coughs> Sorry. I got asked by my mate if they were real and I checked and they are real. I didn't even think to check, but they are. Got the barcode and everything down there. At least I'm I'm like 90% sure. Uh, I'm no professional Beats judger, so I don't know. Uh, but yeah, new and sealed. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what I paid. I think they go for... These black ones I have sold for, I think, 70 to 80 quid new. And I don't think I paid more than 20 for them. So that's a pretty tasty purchase. Um, next up, we've got another game. Oh, I know what this one is. This was the first thing I bought when I decided to buy stuff on Vinted for a video. Uh, this was pretty good. So this is two, two uh, Nintendo Switch games, brand new. Two copies of Minecraft from the same person, uh, all sealed, all new, and I paid £10 each, so 20 quid for both of those. Um, I sold a pre-owned one for £16, so these, uh, you know, if they go for 20 if they go for 25 I only paid 20 for both, so very easy to send, very light. That was a good, that was a good start, that's what um, sort of gave me the idea to do this, but the pile of stuff I've bought is already building up here so uh what we do uh i've got a lot of games i can't lie there was a lot of games so i've got another one here if i can open it i haven't opened this one yet so i'm not sure what it is hopefully it's good please be good ah it's this one. Oh no the case is cracked i may have to get another replacement case then that might be fine bit annoying oh well uh modern warfare 2 the cross-gen edition, this I think goes for about 15 and what will I pay for it? This is like one of those ones where it wasn't a huge profit. I might make a five on it. Maybe I paid like eight. I don't know. Um, but yeah, although with the crack in the case, that is a problem. So I'm going to have to try and get a spare case. That's quite easy. I probably got one. Uh, next, I'll show you this. We'll go into this. This I've opened this, as you can see. So... We have not one, not two, not even three. We've got four Alexas. Four Alexas. Um, someone put up one of these for about five pounds, uh, I think. Five quid? Seven quid? I don't know. And then I bought it and they said, oh, I've actually got four of these. Do you want to buy them all? And I was like, yeah. So I think I paid all in about £27 for four Gen 3 Alexas. They all work. I've reset all of them already. Actually, I tested them. Uh, cause, yeah. These go for 20 to 25 each. I've sold them for 25. I've taken offers at 20 uh, multiple times, even when they're a bit scuffed like that one. This one will probably clean up a little bit. But yeah, I mean, that, if that one's 20 and some of these are 25, I paid 27, I think. So yeah, good bit of profit. Very easy to send. Very easy to test as well. So that's nice. I'm going to begin an Alexa pile down here. Uh, obviously, all the charges as well. A cable for each one, I think. I say that, but there's only... I say that, but there's only three cables in there. Have I lost a cable? Have I been scammed out of a cable? Oh, no, it's here. Got it. So, yeah, four cables, four Alexas. Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Ah, I'm back. So, this I opened to return. Oh, sorry, what am I saying? I opened it and I resealed it to return it. 
as you can see, this is not, this is me, this is my handiwork. And then I missed the return date because I'm an idiot. Oh no, this has loads of dusty, yeah. Uh, so yeah, this is now mine. Um, pretty much what happened, and it's actually not that bad. I don't actually know why I was going to return it because I could have just got a new case, but the case was broken again. So this is actually the second case uh, to break. Got to really open it now. Um, yeah, so I'll just get a new 360 case, but the case is shattered at the bottom. Uh, it's Resident Evil 2 Revelations. I think I paid about 15 quid for it, and I think it's gone for up to 30. I was going to put it on for 25, 30, um, and hopefully make about 10 or 15 quid on it. No manual. But if I can get a new box, um, it should actually be all right, because the, the artwork and stuff looks like it's not damaged. So yeah, there is that uh, bit of a shame. This is the second box now that's broken, so maybe be careful buying individual games on Vinted. Almost forgot the name of it there. Next up, uh, I believe this is another Alexa. Sorry to bore you with all the Alexas. We've got one cable, and we've got the Alexa here. Nicely wrapped, this one. Uh, yeah, another Gen 3. Uh, a few of these I bought, I basically aimed for under £10. Uh, some of them were like 5 50 some of them were 7 I think. And there might have been some at 8 quid. Don't know which one this was, but there's another one. So we've got a stack of 5 now, and actually 6 if you count the boxed new one. So I'm excited to get them listed, because I've kept them hanging around here for a week, or just over a week. And um, yeah, I haven't been able to list them because I've just left them in in these to show you to make the video more intense but uh, it's actually not proving to be annoying um what have we got here another alexa but this time it's a generation far four and it's really dirty as well um yeah it's a bit gross this one i don't know if that'll pick it up it needs a clean i think that was 10 pounds ish uh and they go for a little bit more than the other ones maybe 30 so and they go quite quick so yeah, don't go sniping my electors though. It's my thing. Uh, so this is what was in there. It is a Naus TV smart stick uh, box. Um, it is used, I'm pretty sure, but I, I, I mean, the box is pretty knackered. But the internals, if I can show you, uh, looked fine. I think they said it was un. I don't know if they said it was unused or like hardly used. And it does look hardly used, to be fair. Um, you got the stick there, and then inside. I mean, you've still got the batteries and everything. The batteries aren't even open, so I think it's all new. Checked the internal. Oh, no, I've just knocked the batteries out of their nice new packaging. Um, I checked the remote, and I think it was fine. Yeah, completely corrosion-free. So I think it's probably been used once or twice. It looks like it's been looked after at any rate, so... Yeah. Uh, £10, I think it goes around 25 again sorry if i'm saying i got it for 10 pounds and i didn't pay 10 pounds but i'm guessing uh, i'm going to do that a lot this video but yeah there is probably 15 20 quid profit in that i'm hoping so yeah obviously like i said the profit you can make is smaller than you know if i bought this at a car boot i'd be aiming to pay like three quid for it probably um that's what i've been paying for my now tv stuff recently if you watch my recent videos if i put them up yet um, but yeah, obviously paid 10 quid for this on Vinted, but then I can look it up and I know that I'm going to make money. So it's it's a bit different. The risk is way less. It's just harder to get stuff. And they also put a charger or something in it. I need to check what that is. Next, I'll do another one that I haven't opened yet. Uh, I don't think. So let's open this up. And what is it? Is it fit in? Hmm. Hmm. I wonder, actually. Put your guesses in the comments below now. You know what this sized thing is. Because I think I know what it is. But I could be wrong. It's wrapped in tissue paper. It's going to be Halloween vibes, that. Oh, look at that. It's an Alexa. <laughs> but it's uh, it's a second gen. With, like, a little cable without the um, without a plug. Uh, the condition looks pretty good. Yeah, I think this one was pretty cheap. Uh, these ones go for a bit less. So... The third gens seem to go for 25 to uh, 20, and I think the fourth gens go for about 30 to 25. And I think these are about 20 to 15. That's sort of how it goes, I'm pretty sure. Uh, something like that. Uh, next up, I will do something different. I will do whatever this is. I can't remember what this is. Oh, no, I do remember what this is. There's a bit of a theme here. 
Um, this is a Now TV stick, I think. But now, no, it isn't. It isn't. It's an Amazon Fire stick. I paid like three quid for that. Uh, again, I bought a couple of these on a car boot recently, I think, for 250 each. So now I've got three of these. Hopefully they will work. Hopefully they're worth 15, 20 quid, I'm hoping. I don't actually know. I'll put it up here. Um, next up is this. They packed it in a Sainsbury's bag. What is that? And, and it wasn't even folded. It wasn't even folded nicely, like, you know, like a package. It was just like, I don't want to cover this address, but it was just like that. I, 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 that's the worst packing I've ever seen. I've heard of people sending stuff in like Doritos bags, but yeah, this was pretty poor. Uh, nothing special. Another Alexa. Uh, that is the, what, sixth? sixth third gen so if anyone needs one whoa if anyone needs one let me know uh that was cheap though i think that was like four or five pounds up it was from a, a guy called something called like cheap deals i'm guessing it's cheap because he packs it all in sainsbury's bags that's my guess uh we've not got that many left but there is a couple bangers here so especially the last one so stay tuned for that one uh i haven't opened this one yet oh, i remember this i hope they're real it's an iPod Pro case. The light is not getting very good, by the way. It's getting dark. Uh, yeah, it's an iPod Pro case. Pro AirPod case. I think it's real. Um, I don't know how to tell, to be honest. I. It says this on the back. Will that focus? That's what it looks like. So if anyone in the comments can tell me, it needs a clean. I think that's... I hope that's dirt. Oh, no, that's the light. It, it does need a clean, though. Yeah, this is what it looks like. So if anyone can tell me if that's real. It does have some, some writing on the inside. So yeah, if that is real, I think it's good. Because I think they're worth quite a lot of money. And I didn't pay a lot for it. But it might be fake. I don't know. So there's that. Uh, next up is whatever's in here. That I don't remember what's in here at all. Ah, it's some games. Ah, okay. Yeah. I remember this. Okay, so I've got another copy of uh, the cross-gen... Call of Duty, uh, and then I got, I swear there was another game with these, Call of Duty World War 2 and Call of Duty Black Ops 3, I can't remember what I paid as always, um, but yeah, like I think this one's about 15, I think this one's about 8, 7 or 8, and uh, this one's not great, this one's probably about 4 or 5 quid, maybe even less, uh, but there we go, Call of Duty, fairly popular. Right, now I've got this parcel that went missing for about a week. It was just lost. I, I went into the post office to collect it so many times and they were just like, no, it's not here. But it said on Vinted it was there. Uh, I finally got it when I went to collect a different parcel that isn't there. They gave me this and said, oh, it's not on our system. Here you go. You can take it. And the other parcel I went to collect is now missing. Seems to be a running theme with every or Vinted. I'm going to blame every um, because, yeah, they're not the best. I know I paid a £45 and some pennies for this parcel. And I can show you what's inside. I need to cut it open. Hopefully it's all good because the buyer kept telling me. I'm not a dodgy seller. Uh, I, I said to them, oh, it's, it's gone missing. Sorry, I need to, like, contact um, whoever. And they're like, I'm not a dodgy seller. I promise, I'm not a dodgy seller. I was like, I'm not saying you're a dodgy seller. But should I be worried? So there's three items in here. £45 paid. And it is. They're all the same, pretty much. And it is these. BT... Uh, booster discs now i've got five i think they're smaller than this i think i've got five mini ones for sale and they sell for the well i sold one for 40 pounds the other day um but they go for about 30 to 40 i'm aiming for the higher end because i kind of paid up for those ones but these i think are the same same sort of thing same sort of price uh each has a plug each hopefully is working uh, and there's three of them Yep, so I paid £45. If I can get 30 each, that's 90. That's more than double. If I can get 35, even better. If I can get 40, even better. So that's a good one. Um, glad that showed up. I was a bit worried I was going to lose £45. And now the last one. I think this is the last one. One sec. I'm pretty sure this is the last one. And it's probably the best one. Or it's the most interesting. But here it is. Ooh. Are you ready? Da -da -da -da. It is the Facebook Portal Plus. So this was, I think I paid, again, I think I paid about £40. 
I need to double check what inch the screen is. I think it's about 14 or 15. So I paid 40, it's in like mint condition. The screen has no scratches or anything. Uh, and it's, I'll get it out, shall I? Because it's a bit weird. It's like, I think it's like a conference-y kind of zoom thing. I think that might be like a speaker on the back, maybe. But yeah, it's like this unit like this. And it's got like a camera up here that you can cover and uncover. Uh, and it's got the plug and that. The, the box is in fairly good condition. Uh, it looks like it's not been used, to be honest. A little bit of box damage. Um, I believe they said it's unused or used once or something. But it is a nice box, to be honest. So yeah, paid 40. I think you can get like upwards of 120 for them. Um, maybe more. I will put a sold up here like I have everything else. Uh, but yeah, that's a pretty good one. So I will get this all piled together and we'll have a look at it for what it is. And um, I'll put the grand totals up. And we can sort of judge for ourselves. You can let me know in the comments whether you think it's worth it or not sourcing on Vinted. Bear in mind, uh, you have to spend some hours checking. Uh, but the good thing is you can sort of, as you're watching TV in the evening or chilling in bed just before sleep, if, if you're on your phone, you shouldn't be. But if you are, uh, you can just check there, you know, for 10 minutes. It's basically what I did. And uh, I managed to grab all this stuff. So yeah, and there's more coming. So I might do another one of these in another few weeks. Although I probably won't uh, wait. I don't know. Let me know if you want me to wait and leave them all packed up so we can unpack it together. Or let me know if you don't mind. Um, but I'll get it all laid out now and we'll have a look. Now apologies, it's getting a bit dark now. But this is pretty much all of it. Obviously I haven't included all of these wires because they're messy. So this is what I grabbed. Uh, this is what I spent. I'll put it up now. And this is what I'm expecting to make. Hopefully those have magically appeared. And uh, we can have a look quick. So obviously many Alexas. That one. All of these six. Uh, a boxed one. Which I haven't put up here because I'm an idiot. <laughs> here it is. There. Um, and a second gen. All of this. All these games. Those are sealed. These are not sealed. One damage game. That's sealed. And that's not sealed. Neither are those. But yeah, let me know what you think about that, whether or not you would uh, buy stuff off Vinted and do the same thing, or whether you think it's not worth the time. Um, I don't know how well I've done, so it'll be interesting for me to work it all out and share it with you. Uh, but that being said, like, subscribe, turn on the notifications as well if you haven't, because you'll miss videos otherwise. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next video. It'll probably be a boot sale or a sales video. One of the two. See you next time.